The motor powers your drain auger. After years of use, the motor can fail and no longer work. It can be damaged by water or by accident, such as falling out of your truck. The motor assembly includes the motor, the forward reverse switch, the air switch, the cord clamp, and a hose clamp for the foot switch hose. Replacing the motor is a repair that you can do yourself, and I'm going to show you how. Hi, I'm Mark Socha. Do-it-yourself repairs like these are easier than you might think. From lawn machines to cordless grills, kitchen mixers, outdoor grills, our how-to videos walk you through each repair from start to finish. So doing it yourself means never having to do it alone. Let's get started. I'll begin by removing the foot switch. The air tube may be secured to the air switch with either a hose clamp like this or with a crimp connector. If it's a crimp connector, you'll need to cut it off and replace it. In the case of the hose clamp, I can simply remove it. Now I can remove the tube from the air switch. Now I'll remove the side cover from the motor. Now remove the cord wires from the motor. The black wire, the white wire, and the white wire is connected to the blue wire. So I'll pull both wires away from the switch and then remove the white wire from the blue wire. and now the green grounding wire. With the wires disconnected, I'll remove the cord clamp and pull the cord away from the motor. Next, I'll remove the belt cover. It's secured with two screws. Now remove the motor from the frame. It's secured with four bolts. Now I can install the new motor. I'll need to transfer the pulley from the old motor to the new. The pulley's held in place with a set screw. I'll transfer it over and tighten the set screw. The pulley should be set back as far as it'll go and then brought back forward about an eighth of an inch. And while I have the motor on the bench, I'll go ahead and remove the side cover. I'll place the new motor on the frame and wrap the belt around the motor pulley. Then I'll secure the motor with the bolts.
Now I'll reinstall the belt cover. Now I can reattach the cord. I'll remove the cord clamp from the new motor and place it onto the cord. I'll place the wires through the housing. and secure the cord in place with the clamp. Now I'll reconnect the wires. I'll start with the ground wire. The motor includes a new ground wire screw. I'll reconnect the black wire to the air switch and the white wire to the forward reverse switch. Now I can replace the motor side cover. Now reinstall the hose from the foot switch. I'll connect the hose to the air switch and secure it with the clamp. And now you know how to replace the motor on your drain auger. Be sure to check back often for new videos and expert advice. If you found this video helpful, give us a thumbs up and leave a comment.